What's going on guys? It is Michael and Gabe here. We've got a fun video for you guys. We're gonna be asking Michael some questions. Is he asking me questions too? No, you're asking him. I'm only asking you questions. So buddy, you're in the hot seat today. Ooh. Starting off with the T of the T of the T. Dun, dun, dun. Who is your favorite sibling? So I already answered this in, in the most popular video. It says, and I quote, I'm I'm fishing with my brother, why wouldn't I be? My brother. You are my favorite sibling. I'm your favorite sibling out of Abby and Sierra? Yes. Yes, you are. Like no without even like a question. Without a question, yes, you're my favorite sibling. <laughs> your your name on my phone is favorite sibling. <laughs> Alright, well that makes you feel good, Mike. Thank you, Mike. Mm -hmm. Who is your favorite? Me or Drew? I uh, have to think about this That's one. That's hard. I love y'all both equally. I guess that's a fair answer. I'll take it. I'll take it. What is your favorite thing that Drew cooks? Spaghetti. Her spaghetti? And he hates spaghetti. I love Drew spaghetti. So I, Drew spaghetti is by far the best spaghetti, hands down. And usually, I hate spaghetti. I don't like spaghetti, but her spaghetti... That is good. You like your spaghetti? Yes. Oh, sure. <laughs> Michael, we're pulling out the big guns, dog. We are pulling out the big guns. Ready? What do you want to be when you grow up? Engineer. You want to be an engineer? Mm -hmm. What do you want to engineer? What what field of engineering do you want to be in? I want to work like a, in a power plant. You want to be an engineer at a power plant? Yeah. Very cool. All right, Michael. A lot of people are asking, I don't feel this way, but a lot of people are asking, how does it feel to like know me and like basically be a part of me and Drew's TikToks and you know, since me and her have a large following and we do social media, how does it feel being the brother that's kind of connected to it all? What do you, how do you feel? Do you like it? Do you not like it? What's the pros and cons? Well, I think it's pretty cool having a famous brother because you can always go to their house, make videos, and if he's my favorite sibling, it's fun. <laughs> so, um, a couple other people ask you, do people at school recognize you? Do you get recognized out in public? Have you ever been recognized like, oh my gosh, that's Michael? Especially since one of our biggest videos, actually our biggest video on TikTok with over 26 million views is a video of you. Do you ever get recognized? Yes, actually. A lot of people in my school to walk up to me every day and be like, hey, I love your videos. I love watching them. I'm like, oh, thank you. That makes me feel good. That makes me feel good about myself. Sweet. So do you post your own videos that they're talking about? Or are they talking about watching me and Drew's videos? Watching videos? you and Drew's videos with me in it. And they enjoy that? Yeah. That's good. And do you like the publicity? I don't know what that word is. Do you like, do you like, do you like the, um, the fame part of it? Like the, yeah. the, the people like noticing you? Nice. I like that, Mike. All right, Mike, this is getting hard. I gotta throw a hard question in there. What is your least favorite thing about me? What is the your way least... you've been going to the gym a lot because I can't hang out with you that much anymore like I used to. Really? And when you moved out of the house, that I, I cried for a day because I, I, I missed you so much. And it is like, so your least favorite thing about me is when I moved out of mom and dad's house? Yeah. I think I've been out of their house now for almost three years. Yeah. That's crazy. It's all right. You get to come to me and Drew's house now. Yeah. It's better. <laughs> it's better. It's better. It's better. It's better. It's better. <laughs> Michael, what was your first impression of Drew when we first started dating? You're going to hate this. <laughs> I think she was going to use you for popularity and stuff. Use me for popularity? Yeah. Why? Why? I, I don't know. I just had that feeling. And then... <laughs> I was popular. <laughs> you thought she was using me? Yes. Why? Because I was like popular? But how does it, how do you feel knowing like now on the other end of things, like seven years later, she's the famous one. <laughs> and like, I, 
I don't use her, but like I, I'm kind of in her shadow. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. How old, <laughs> oh, how the tables have turned. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So with that being said, your first initial thought of Drew. What do you think about Drew now? Like, how do you feel about her and that type of thing? Well, how I feel about her now, I think she's fun, more active right now. She loves going and fishing with us. I mean, not really fishing. She she loves uh, going on walks and videoing us. I think it's kind of cool. <laughs> I'm asking, what do you think about her? Not now, but like, why though? Who told you that? No one. I <laughs> for some reason I had that feeling, but now. Now you all right, he said. Yeah. So what was your opinion on me and Drew getting married when we were 20 years old, when we were young? We're still young, we're only 21. We've been married a year and like a half. But I think when y'all first got married, I thought you were going way too fast. Even though y'all dated for like five years, I was like, 20 years old, golly! <laughs> there is no crumbs left, he's just giving it all. So you, so you didn't like me and Drew getting married early? Mm -mm. You didn't like it? Why? I think y'all were moving too fast. You thought we were moving too fast? <laughs> yeah. What you mean? Like, y'all, I mean, I, well, not looking back at it, y'all dated for like five years. So, I mean, I get it. But <laughs> at the time that y'all got married, I was like, I was like, 20 years old, that my mind's blown. So Michael, in life, in whole, like out of everybody, it could be a famous person, it could be a family member, it could be anyone. Who do you look up to the most in your life? I kind of have two people. Okay. It's you and Paul. Oh, Oh, Mike. Okay, well elaborate on why you look up to Paul, Paul and then I'll let you elaborate on why you look up to me. So, I elaborated with Paul Paul. I don't know if I said that right. But anyway, um, <laughs> um, you, because he just, we don't get to see him that often. So, when I do see him, he, I, <clears throat> he, like, it just, I don't know. I just, I just look up to him. It's like, he's a good dude. You just respect him and yeah. you look up to him because he's like a good role model. What about me? What? Why do you look up to me? Well, I look up to you for the same reasons, and because you're my brother. <laughs> Mike, how do you feel about me and Drew doing social media full time and living life the way we do, making videos, making content, stuff like that, versus when I worked, uh, you know, normal hours and normal job? So, I think there's pros and cons to this question. Okay, we'll elaborate. So, the pros, um, I think, well, since now you're doing social media, I can see you more often. Yeah. You're not working that much anymore. You can, you can do this, you can do this anywhere. Yeah. And I think it's cool. The cons, wait, yeah, the, <laughs> the cons is, there's not really any cons, actually. There's not any cons. So you just like it? Uh, yeah. You think it's pretty cool? Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. How do you mind? Now this is a juicy question, bro. It's a juicy question, bro. What do you think? Do you want me and Drew to have kids now or later? And if later, how far later? Well, and I why? I kind of want you to have them now. Okay. So I can be the uncle, the only uncle. So I can be. Uncle Mikey or Uncle Mike? <laughs> you think that'd be cool? Oh, yeah. <laughs> you think you'd be our? You think you'd be our kid's favorite uncle? Our favorite, 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 like aunt, uncle, anything, like favorite. Yes. I think so too. Mikey boy. <laughs> if given the option to live with me and Drew right now, yes. And fit. What? Yes. <laughs> You didn't even let me finish! Yeah, I mean, I got all the details. Would you rather live with Drew and Gabe? Yes. <laughs> okay, so that's that. That's that. So given the option, you would come live with me and Drew? Yes. Her cooking's the ball. <laughs> How did you feel in the moment when you found out that I was in the hospital and everybody was coming to see me because I had the brain tumor? 
How did you feel? What was going through your mind? Were you kind of nonchalant, like, oh, okay? Or were you kind of like, oh gosh, what's going on? Like, well, how, do you, how did you feel about the situation? I felt like you were going to die. It's like, it made me sad. And I thought that we weren't going to be able to see you a lot. And then it just turned out good. I mean, not really good, but it turned out better. <laughs> what is your least favorite memory of me or with me or anything? Like, what's your thing that you think, oh my gosh, like that sucked or that hurt my feelings or whatever it is? What, when do you think, like, what's one thing about a memory meme you share or something that you, like, just did not like? When, <laughs> when, um, uh, it was when we were young and you used to, when I was young, and, uh, you used to still live with mom and dad. Uh huh. And I'd come and sleep in your bed. Uh huh. And then mom and dad would come in and tell me to get out. That's your least favorite memories? I remember because I, I just got a queen size bed. Used to hide under your covers. I would Michael would literally come to my room at night and be like, "Dude, I'm scared. Can I sleep with you?" And I'd be like, "Yeah, bro, that's fine." And then I remember Dad would come in there and be like, "Where's Michael?" I'm like, "Dude, I don't know." He'd pull the covers and Michael would be hiding. And remember when you were little, you were so little, and you'd be like, "What?" And Dad'd be like, "Go to your room." <laughs> and you were like. All right, you guys, so that concludes all the questions this time with Mikey Boy. Guys, if you have any more questions you want me to ask Michael, or if you have any questions you want Michael to ask me, comment them down below. Let us know what those questions are. Guys, we appreciate you. We love every single one of you. If you're not already subscribed, hit the notification bell, turn it on. You'll be notified when me and Drew post our videos, and Big Mike's beautiful face will be all over your YouTube feed. Michael, tell them what's up. Yeah, that's what's up. <laughs> what should they do? Hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. Like that video and make a comment. Alrighty. And we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.